Good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. This is the very high-tech Veltins Arena. Somehow fitting for this part of the world, the industrial hub that is the region of West Farley. Bielefeld have chosen to go 4-3-3. Jim, how do you see it? Yeah, Peter, you can look at this formation one minute and think that it is 4-3-3, and the next time you check, it'll be 4-5-1. And it's all to do with whether you've got the ball or not, and the wider attacking players being asked to apply defensive discipline too. When it does turn to a five across midfield, then the shape of this team takes on a much tidier, compact defensive look. Jim, see making a difference here. Yeah, Leroy Sané, he's one of the most fleet-footed players around, Peter, and a massive threat with the ball at his feet. He knows where the goal is too, and his finishing is both precise and very effective. He's going to add a real dynamism to this forward line, either looking for the through ball on the counter or taking on his man and, and going on his own. Hard well, to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. Is on the back foot. Now it's Canabri. 11. He's gone for it! Marvellous goal! What a start and what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Bayern Munich are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. But what are they trying to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Pavard demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Oh, shooting chance! That has certainly tested the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Muller. And it's played forward. Been just the early goal here, and the score is 1 0. It's found its way to him. He's off on a marauding run. Well, the whistle's gone. What's he given? And the referee's decided that he was fouled outside the box, and it is just a free kick. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he?
He's gone for goal. Well, he probably expected to do a lot better considering the position he was in. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Right through the middle. Sané. And Sané! Sticks it away! A two-goal lead and they're firmly in control. I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. Bayern Munich get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Gieb. Has gone out. Keeper and go again. Keeper's got good distance on that. Hernandez tries to get it forward quickly. Lewandowski and he's cut it out. Big chance! In double quick time! Now looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Forward it goes. Goretzka. Gnabry. Had a shot. With the keeper. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong, make them right. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Bielefeld can't seem to retain possession. Sare. It's Lewandowski. Gnabry, and he's, he's gone for it! They've done it! And already they're looking to run away with it. That really is quite fabulous, all his own doing. Gnabry showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box, only to completely kind of flood the finish? Not him. Bayern Munich tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Hoists it high. Looking for space out wide. It's a good stubborn defending there. The defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. 
Sané. And the shot! No mistake! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! It's part of the game, Peter. It has to get ruthless. Sympathy just doesn't play a part. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. It's become a case of men against boys. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play and uh, it makes even less sense. for half time. Well, that flew by. It was breathless stuff. It's been one way traffic here after the first 45 minutes. A relentless barrage that looks set to continue. Yeah, I think the first half performance that showed attack being the best form of defence. If they're in the face of the opposition that much, then there's little they can do in return. And I'm, I'm not sure how long they can keep the intensity and the tempo up, but it certainly paid off so far. Bayern Munich, utterly dominant in the first 45 minutes, scoring at will. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Looks to clip it forward. Whip hits one! And that's why. Well, he did get himself into a good position, something for him to cling to. on the right flank. Now, what's next? Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Turns it out wide. Muller, Gnabry, now it's Sané, he's through and all along, Sané! Oh, what a goal! A finish right from the top draw! A contest no more, it is nothing short of utter humiliation. Listen, when you're on an invitation to improve your goal difference, ways off. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Oh, this has been an immense contribution from one player. He's been just about unplayable. It's an irresistible force today. Van der Horn, Guillem, hoists it forward, Sané, plays a clever pass, away from immediate danger,
it's always a good time to register and, and lay down a, an early marker in the second half. They clearly had exactly that in mind. Oh, Rick gets up to head it! Now it's Canabri. Just brushed off the ball there. Forward it goes. It's got through to him. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Goes for goal! He scores! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Bielefeld have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Bielefeld playing for pride here, the match surely be on them. Goretzka with a delicate ball. Up for a throw. It's a throw. it forward Bielefeld uh, keeping their men at arm's length here yeah I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard Pavar and it's Sané let down by a lack of accuracy Sané is being picked on here well, he helps himself to a treble, Peter, and then they switch on. It's a bit late now. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. The changes then in quick succession. Looks to bypass the midfield. Well, that's where he wants it. Shula. Tries to get it forward quickly. Gnabry. It's got loose. Sané. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Battles to win it back, and it's played forward. Davis. Now oh, they can break here. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Just a few moments from glory. Tries lifting it over. Knocks it away. Goretzka. He's through the middle. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Bayern Munich seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. Has he picked him out? Sané. So who's he picking out? Crunching tackle. It's a loose ball. And it's Goretzka. 
And the counter is on. Hoists it forward. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. There's a long ball. That intervention was very necessary. And that is that. Bayern Munich have won it in what has been the perfect end to the pre-season. Whilst it's no guarantee of success when the new campaign does get underway in a week or so, it is surely a significant boost to morale and a significant statement of intent. And now the moment. The ceremony and the presentation of the trophy to come. The very first trophy of a new season. So many more might follow. How many we will find out over the course of the months ahead.